G'day guys, welcome back to Ron's Relics and Coins. Right oh, I'm back at this um, school oval, second weekend. Um, it was fairly muddy and everything came over that way. Got a few dollar coins and two dollar coins. A bit of jewellery. Down towards this way here, there's an old goal post, baseball thing there. I started getting pennies and, and, and stuff there. So I'm going to hit this side of the oval, because I think that might be the oldest side of the oval. And um, I'll get back to you on my first decent find. Alright, see you soon. Yeah, a little bit windy today, so I hope the wind doesn't interfere with the mic too much. Because it's blowing a bit of a gale. But no, uh, at least it's not raining, the ground's not wet. A bit chattery. Mm, that's going to be five cent piece, I think. 14 15, that's five cent piece. Okay. No. Yeah, um, uh, we got here probably about 15 minutes ago, so about 25 to, uh, 12 so a little bit late today all right now I'm guessing it's five cent piece straight in and there okay he's out And I was wrong. Bit of crushed up can. <laughs> uh, Alright, we'll clean this up. Okay, I got a 64. 63, 64. About six inches down. Where are you? About there. Just turn this camera up a little bit. Right. Okay. Okay, just there. I missed him a little bit. Shovel, are you? No? Where are you? Hmm. Okie dokie. Okie dokie dokie. Check it with a detector again. I must have been a bit off. Okay. Well, I won't waste power and time. I'll come back to you as soon as I find it. Alright, hey guys, found him. There he is there. That's where I had the plug. I was over here. I must have been looking away when I um, pinpointed. <laughs> dollar coin all right first goldie all right we'll fix this up and we'll move along all right um i'm near that gold post where i got the pennies from the other day the other weekend and uh i got a 60 oh, i can't remember what it was now 
64, 62. Hang on, we'll have another look at the number. Sixty two, sixty four. Right. But it's not a dollar coin or anything. Alright. What do we got? Mm. Yeah, the soil's not real polite to the copper coins. Um, then I got the other day, the pennies. Couldn't get much of a bloody um, date off them or anything. But anyway, we've got another, got another one here. And God, she's crusted. Yeah. Can't even get a date or anything off that one. But she's green. Can't quite see. She's that caked up. But it is a penny of some sort. But anyway, that's good. We'll see what we can find on the next next one. I'll just double check that hole. Yeah, no, that's all she wrote. Um, okay, yeah, I don't know what the go is with the soil here because, jeez, it's savage on copper coins. And that came up as a 62, 64. Yeah, no more in there. All right. I'm gonna probably guess, maybe a Britannia? At that, that number, maybe. I'm not too sure. It's been ages since I've picked up a bloody uh, Britannia coin. Thirty-two, thirty-four. Yeah, thirty-two, thirty-four. All right, we'll have a look at that. Hmm. Yeah, I can't remember what a Britannia comes up as now. Been ages since I had one. It's been ages since I've had any any decent predecessors. <laughs> Silvers anyway. Okay. Okay, so it's in the bottom of the plug here. Right. What have we got in there? Bit of can. Catch you on the next one. Okay, guys. Yeah, I'm getting into where the um, goalpost is. I'm getting into this like ash, like sandy, gritty ash. But it's um, yeah, it's burnt, burnt stuff. About probably six inches down. Anyway, cut it short. I've got another little penny just here. Let's see what we can get off this one. It might be because it was a burnt ash. It's, but all the coins have been in a fire or something, maybe. Uh, hmm. Not quite sure what that one is. I don't really want to go scratching them.
Who is dead? That's KG6. It's a Rue Penny. 1945 Rue Penny. You ripper. Yeah, that's another one. Alright, need a few more. Alright. As I said, yeah, it's like a sandy ash. It's had things melted through it. So there might have been a fire or a house fire or something on this land here before the school. Who knows? Yeah. Right oh. See you on the next one guys. Yeah, just a a little handle, a little handle of something. It's got a hole in that end. And a flat top on that end. And uh, I'm thinking that's what it might be. I like, like a little knob off a handle or something. I don't know. Hey, alright. Catch you on the next. Right, oh, I got a 46, 47, and usually that rings up as a 50 cent piece, and there's one right there. Yeah. Five bob. <sighs> okay, small change. All right, now I'm into the mud. So it makes me wonder if it was a house that was burnt down there or it was an actual driveway. So that's where the mud is just there. Come across here and that's like that fire ash just here. So it makes me wonder if that was a driveway or if that's where the building was because there's none here. There, I'll work that out as I go through the pattern. All right. See you soon. All right, that's where I got the 50 cent piece. They say you always double check your hole before you fill it. Well, I filled it. Right beside it, 66, 67. Just beside the bloody plug. It's probably a dollar or two dollar coin. And it had to be on the hinge part of the, the plug that I made. <laughs> All right, let's see. Just there. All right. see what we got now okay so I moved it what have we got ah it's a dollar a dollar right beside it righto all right we'll fix that up but I'll double check it before I um, put the plug back in eh <laughs> uh, one day you think I'd learn Okay, no more there. Alright, fix that up. Yeah, it's got a bit of trash in the ground, so it's very... So now that's where the ash was, just there. So it makes me wonder if it's a driveway or something. Sixty-two. Seventy-one. Hmm. Be 
Yeah, and eight inches down, six inches down. All right. And we got ourselves a half penny. By looking at it, you a little ripper. A little half. Commonwealth. And there's his there's his imprint. Got the circle on there. <laughs> uh nineteen nineteen twenty nine Commonwealth Halfpenny. You little ripper. Uh, that's KG five beautiful all right we'll keep on swinging eh all right just crush that dirt in there all right here we go again tab or 10 cent piece mm. Ooh. 68 69 about four inches down okay that wasn't very far from the other one and now we're getting into that ash okay. So it makes me wonder if it was a house burnt down here or a um, driveway. That's what I'm thinking. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. But it's like that grey, grey colour to it. It could be road base. I, I wouldn't have a clue. Yeah, it could be road base. Right. Okay, so it's going to be in the plug. <clears throat> What's that? Oh, no, it's a badge. A badge. school pretty little badge right red in the middle all right all right I'll get you back to you on the uh, next one <laughs> yeah, you gotta laugh at that here I am probing around probing around probing around and I can't find it I had a 61 62 then I couldn't find it and I thought oh, I'll start breaking the plug and I still couldn't find in the bloody plug. Have a guess what fell out over here. <laughs> Two dollars. <laughs> Didn't even see it land out on the grass. <laughs> uh, Alright. Uh, we've got ourselves an 80... 89, 90. 89, pretty much. About eight inches down. Okay, we'll have a look at that one. So it's not in the plug. It's over to the side there. Oh yeah, you gotta love. 
above that. So it comes up as 80, what did I say? 89.90. And we got one just here, look. You little ripper. Another Rue Penny. 58 or 59 cool great stuff all right beautiful loving the old predeces all right we'll catch you on the next beautiful all right the reason why i'm not trying to do so many lies is i'm trying to save power on my bloody gopro stupid batteries don't know what's going on with them they're brand new and they don't bloody hold charge. But anyway, got ourselves another penny just here. Uh, ah, yes. What have we got? KG5. And it's a Commonwealth one penny, and we're looking at nineteen nineteen. Great stuff. Awesome. Good choice being on this side of the Goldies, because it must be the older side of the oval. That's awesome. and we'll move along to the next one and hopefully I'll get another one because geez I tell you what I could do with a couple of silvers would be nice all right all right see you soon hey I've got another one here 60 uh, 60 69 70 thereabouts got another one there in front of it 28 that's the one I'm interested in, that little high tone. Alright, let's have a look at this one, and then I'll have a look at that other one. Now though, we're getting back into that ash. You can hear it. Straight down there. A little bit off on me pinpointing. <coughs> Alright, still there. Oh yeah, a bit crunchy. Okay, got him out by the sound of it. This thing is chattering away. All right. Right there, what do we got? Hello, what's that? No, that's the imprint. Where are you? the imprint of a, ooh, a famous two cent piece <laughs> be buggered <laughs> bugger righto <laughs> we'll double check the hole and then we'll move along I haven't got very far I've only gone in around this sort of area here that's where I've been picking up all the pennies and stuff like there and there's the goalpost so I haven't ventured very far, only in this little spot. But I'm slowly heading towards, I think that 
it's either a baseball area it's all cornered off or it's a uh, like a oh, I wouldn't say discus or shot put or something like that I'd say it'd be baseball but anyway enough jibber jabber fill this in and we'll get going as I suspect as I suspected it was a 10 cent piece that 28 29 that was just up past that other um, other target yeah so the 10 cent piece all right but you've got to dig them numbers because they could be something else oh dear great day at least it's not raining blue sky <laughs> loving it all right let's see what we can get next bit chattery maybe I should have had smaller coil on probably a 20 cent piece maybe maybe a 20 cent piece there but I'm not chasing the currency I'm chasing the old ones oh, I'm getting out of where that wood ash is whatever it is right <clears throat> okay in the plug oh yeah what have we got ah bloody pull tab Okay, I've got a 6970 high tone. About four inches down. <coughs> 7172. Okay, let's have a look. I'm going to say it's a one cent piece. Maybe. Let's have a look. Then again, it could be a piece of bloody keen too. Okay, still in the centre. And I think it's going to be a can. I think. A uh, bit of wire there. A bit of rusty wire. Okay, sit that there. Oh, what's that? That's another bit of twisty wire. I'd say that's what it's going to be. Yeah, a bit of rust. Yeah, rusty wire. All right, nothing to see here, move along. <laughs> okay, I think I've got ourselves another dollar or two dollars. Um, just in here, two dollars. Just there. Right, I think I might have to go back to where that bloody burnt ash stuff is. That seems to be where all the old pre desis are. So I'm getting out of it now. I'm getting rid of cans and two cent pieces and gold coins and that ten cent pieces. So I might have to go back that way and see what I can get over there. But I was going to go in that little baseball area there and have a swing in there and see how far I go. No particular pattern, I'm just sort of wandering.
Okay, might have ourselves another Goldie. Probably a dollar or so. Okay, let's have a look. Whereabouts are you? Not that they are, yeah, in the plug. And it's a dollar. A big nice dollar. Right. See you on the next. I might head back over that way. I'm getting out of the old predecies. Okay, we've got ourselves an 80, 86, 87. Uh, it's not very deep. Probably a two cent piece. But, we'll have a look. Be some Mike, uh, the media mod for the GoPro. I hope it's working all right with the um, the mic with the wind. All right. Okay, got him out. And what do we got? What is that? A bloody bottle top, no. Um, looks like an eyelet. An eyelet of some sort. Yeah, I'm not sure. But anyway, got it out. Alright, we'll move along. Okay, we've got a 46, 47. Pretty close to the uh, surface. Double tapping pretty quick. I'm guessing it's going to be a 50 cent piece. Just there. So it's only a surface fine, so I'm going to guess it's a 50 cent piece on that one. Alright. Then again, I might be wrong, it might be a bloody pull tab. I oh know, 50 cents. There you go. Right on top of the surface. Righto. I've been trying to call that magpie over to get a feed of worms, but he won't come over to me. <laughs> uh, you hang, they hang around when you dig a few holes. <laughs> Alright, see you soon. Uh, got ourselves a 67, 68. About four inches down, just there. Alright, oh. I'll have to be changing the battery on the GoPro in a second. Alright, oh, where are you? Just see at the corner of the plug. Where are ya? Oh, there he is. Door. Alright. I'll change this battery over in the GoPro before it does bloody die on me. Alright. I'll be back. Okay, got ourselves a 40, 41, 20 cent piece, I'd say. You see? About two inches down or so. 
He said, we'll grab him. Save me looking for him next time. Oh. Yeah. I went and bought, um, oh, Wondershare, uh, video editing program to, uh, to learn it and I've uh, been having a lot of hassles with the phone because the phone's just not got enough memory in it. So, um, that way I can load it up to the computer and I know the files are all going to be there. And, um, that way I can keep them in order because sometimes when I put them up onto the bloody phone, first, second, third or whatever, the um, file will be in the wrong spot. And that one's 20 cent pieces, I thought. Um, yeah, so yeah, I think it cost me $130 for the um, year. Or oh, lifetime, lifetime bloody subscription or whatever it was, I think it was. And um, hopefully that'll be better. So I've been learning that over the last few days, trying to get it done. I had this other one, but the graphics on my uh, laptop wasn't um, uh, big enough. So yeah, all right. So hopefully that'll be that'll turn out better than like I've been using InShot. Don't get me wrong. InShot's pretty good. I love the I love the little program, but the phone just doesn't have enough physical memory to hold everything. And then when you go to encode it or uh, encode it before you upload it, it tells you you've got to delete stuff off your phone to make room. And with the um, uh, what have I got? Uh, Samsung Galaxy S21. It doesn't hold a card. It's just in physical memory. And I find... Oh, bloody keen. Um, that's just not good enough. So I thought I'd try something different with a computer. And be able to store everything on it. So, and also... As soon as it's um, encoded... It automatically uploads it straight to um, YouTube or TikTok or whatever you want to choose. So that's not too bad. All right. I'll see you soon. Okay, guys. I'm just here on this side of the goalpost. If you can just see the goalpost just there. That's where I've been getting the pennies and that up there. That's the baseball place over there. And I've been working my way back up to this rough uh, burnt stuff underneath the ground where it is ash. And then I come across this little signal. And, uh... 80, 87, 79, 90. Eh. And I thought, oh, I'll be chasing a bloody can. So I opened it up. And, uh... Just there. In this little clump of dirt, I did see it, but I haven't touched it. But anyway, we got ourselves a little sixpence. First little silver for today. And it's a, uh, oh, he's had a bit of a bash. He's flat on the edge. Yeah, he's flat on the edge. Uh, coat of arms. Uh, what year? 19. 19. Jeez, Christ, I can't read that. Must be a bit bird. 19. Is it 1941? 
I'm not sure. He's got a bit of a dingle on the top there, if you can see that. And it's KG6. Yeah, beautiful. All right, catch you on the next one. Okay, that's where I got the little sixpence from, just there. And then I swung it across. Got a nice high tone there, 70, 71. About six inches down. Okay, let's have a look, see what we got here. Right, so. So I'm guessing, being this close to the top of the surface, it's going to be a one cent piece. I reckon. Well, I've got it in my hand. What have we got? a bloody tin or copper or whatever it is all right alloy or something that's shiny all right in there you go all right see you soon bye joe i've gone and done it again i'm just underneath this um just in the sort of behind this old goalpost anyway about almost pin pinpoint of depth and I've got this other little this other little blighter and a little thrippens and he's still stuck in situ just there there's his imprint uh, what have we got which one have we got KG6 Little strippy, uh, 19, 1951, great stuff, oh my daughter, she's messaged me, messaged me every couple of seconds, <laughs> I better see what she wants, <laughs> alright I'll be back, okay I've got a little iffy scratchy high tone, 75, 76, turn that off, yeah, about 6 or 8 inches down, alright, we'll have a look at that one, Ah. I better not start humming, huh? Okay, it's not in the plug. Down the Still down in the plug, in the, oops, what's that? Oh, that is. Scraping. What's that? Oh, I don't like the sound of that. What's that? It's big. Ah. Oh. Well, there you go. 
bloody tent peg. <laughs> oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Yeah, it goes from one signal to another is different. I will right, we'll double check that. Just in case there's something else in there with that. Nah, she's all over. on the next one guys okay I've got a 9091 but it's only about four inches down so I'm gonna think it's a piece of can maybe what I think it's going to be anyway but we'll have a look I don't think it'll be a penny or anything that close up to the top of the surface surely probably a bit of canting alright let's have a look alright it should be in the plug Doki. Oh, ooh. it's got a little spiky thing on it. It's got a pin. Um, that's a school badge. Mini Vinnie's leader. Got a nice little bloody pin still on it. A bit prickly. Righto, that's all right. Chuck that in there. You watch, I'll get pricked with it. <laughs> Righto. All right, see you soon. All right, I think I found myself a coin spill. <laughs> I'll just fix this up so you can see. Right, there, there and there. I don't know what they are, but Let's have a look. There's two. Nah. What are they? One cent pieces. I think. No, nah, five cent pieces, are they? And 20 cents. And two fives. So 30 cents. And that's all she wrote in there. So 30 cents out of there. <laughs> right on. Getting a few things in the pouch. Right on. I will see you on the next one. Gone and done it again, guys. Woohoo! I'm sort of in line with that bloody ash stuff, whatever that is. But anyway, got ourselves another penny. KG6. So that'll be another rude penny, I'd say. Um, yeah, it's a rue. Can just make it out there. Ah, nineteen fifty. I mean, fifty one or sixty one? 
51. Rue Penny. You ripper. Just the, there's the cricket pitch just there. So I'm making my way back to the car because, yeah, three o'clock. So by the time I make it back to the car, it'll be time to go home. All right, clean this up. And uh, if I catch anything in between there and there, I'll put it up. All right, see ya. All right, got another faint high tone just here. Because that's where I just got the penny from, just there. 85, 89. Mm, could be two cents. But it's all the way down. Okay. Okay, we'll have a look at that one, eh? Can't walk away from that. Hang on, pull me bloody belt back up. away from those little slight high tones. Right. Right oh. Okay, check plug now. Straight down there. Right oh. Okay. Okay, what's going on there? Everything's everything's a target. Okay, not in there. Straight down there. Oh, there he is. There he is. Just over here. Right there. Another penny. Oh, God, they're crusty. Oh, crusty as. Oh, look at that. Big bubble stuff on there. Yeah. This soil is not real good for them. I don't know why. All right, we'll just double check that again. Hang on, check it with the detector. Ah. Move the shovel. Okay, no more in there. Okay, well that's two within a meter. Catch you on the next one. Okay guys, that's it for me today. Not too bad. A few pennies, a couple of silvers. And I've still got all that there to go. If I'm not here next weekend, it'll be the weekend after. But yeah, not too bad. All right, I'll catch you when I upload the video. And I uh, hope it's uh, all right. All right, see you then. See you guys. Hi there guys, welcome back to Ron's Relics and Coins. Alright, I've got my uh, coins and my finds done for the second weekend at the uh, new permission. I dare say there's going to be at least another three or four. I'm hoping to get there next weekend, but we'll see how we go. Alright, so this is what i got so far. Um, I've got a 1959 or 58 uh, Rue Penny. Queen Elizabeth II on that one. Uh, a 1919 Commonwealth uh, one penny. Uh, that's KG6. And uh, got another Rue penny there. I think it's 1952. Uh, 
1952. And this one here, I can't get the last numeral off there. It's 1950 something. I just can't get it. It's a little bit crusty. Um, this one here, a 1945 Rue Penny. This one here, as I said, like it was like an ash or road base or something like that. And you can actually see it it's still stuck to it. I, mean, I cannot get a thing off that one. She's that bad. Like, it's, yeah, melted to it or whatever it is. Um, little half Commonwealth penny. We're looking at uh, 1929. I don't know if it'll focus. Yeah, 1929. And then I've got a sixpence. 1941. Yeah, I've got a little bit of a flat edge on the top there. And then we've got a 1951 Thrippens. Nice and clean, that one. A little bit tarnished on the back. Uh, okay, call me spendables <laughs> when they clean them up. Uh, 10 cents in 5 cent pieces. We've got 40 cents in 10 cent pieces. 80 cents in 20s, $2 in 50 cent pieces, $10 in $2 coins, uh, $6 in $1 coins, a little bunch of 2 cent pieces and 1 cent pieces, um, a little school badge, so there's another school badge there, and then famous and all the famous, there's all my junk. Always comes home with me, goes in the bin, or in the little bucket there for recycle. Yeah, all right, so I'm hoping to get out there next weekend. If not, it'll be the following one. So always remember, it's always fun to go detecting. Always remember to fill in your holes. Until next time, thanks for watching, and please subscribe and like. See ya.